Hello and welcome to the 47th tutorial on the Cocos 2DX version 3C++ tutorial series and in this tutorial we're going to show you how to create a new scene. This tutorial assumes you've done tutorial 45 if you haven't don't worry there will be a link in the description to the source code or you can implement it directly into your own project plus there will be another link in the description to the source code produced from this tutorial. So let's just go ahead and open up our folder. First thing you want to do, the easy way to create a new scene is just duplicate the, an existing scene that you've got and we're just going to just rename this new scene rename the CBP as well new scene because that way we can just make, make a few changes in each of these we've got a new scene set up instead of creating it every time again and again now, one thing to note is if you're developing for Android you want to go to your project Android folder it'll work fine on iOS but on Android you need to change this android.mk file which is located in project.android JNI then android.mk it's just opening it up with a text editor I'm just going to use sublime now what you want to do here you just want to add the new file that you've added so you just do backslash do dot 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 forward slash dot 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 forward slash classes because that's where it is forward slash it was called new scene but this is only if you're developing for android and just open it up in xcode What we want to do is simply go to our classes folder again, select our new scene, drag and drop them onto classes, just leave them as they are because they're already in the right folder. Uh, multiple errors occur. Let's just do I I know why it was. If we uncheck that, click finish, because they already existed. Uh okay, okay, so if we just go to the new scene hate, just chain this hash if not defined, which just prevents multiple copies being included which would cause errors and chain is hash define as well to new scene chain the class name to what it's going to call it we're going to call it new scene doesn't really matter what it is change this to new scene we are simply going to get rid of all of this and now if you have a look it should be all good to go we can change this comment as well it doesn't matter if we change the comment but it's probably best practice to change it go to your cpp file uh, we are going to remove all of this we're going to remove our menu uh, and we'll remove the sprite as well we will add a new menu but we'll do that in the next tutorial and um, we'll just go up we just change the hello world scene to new scene.h change every instance of hello world to new scene copy and paste that so change it there change it there and change it there and then now if we run this sorry about that Okay, it works fine. We have a new scene created. In the next tutorial, we're going to look at how to push that scene on to the stack. If you have any questions, feel free to message us at support at solonarsystem.co.uk. The email will be in the description. Or you can just comment on this video or directly message us via YouTube. All the required links for the source code will also be in the description. And as usual, thanks for watching and have a nice day.